Seriously, would you run? I would, I'm seriously considering it, yes. Looks like we have a handful of celebrities who believe they'd make good political leaders. Today, we'll check out a few celebrities who ran for office. Number 6. In late April 2021, the reality star and Olympian initiated a campaign to unseat California Governor Gavin Newsom as the Republican candidate. Oh, my fellow Republicans! Yay! Identifying as a compassionate disruptor, Jenner, in her initial paperwork, highlighted her affection for California and her dedication to safeguarding the well-being of its residents. However, However, she only scored 1% of the total votes. Number 5. According to a survey, 46% of Americans expressed their backing for a presidential candidacy from The Rock. Run for president talk has kind of been in the ether. Like almost 50% of Americans would support me running for president. It was just crazy. And the actor responded to this on Instagram saying he was humbled. The Rock discussed the prospect of running for president on different occasions back in 2017 as well as 2022. There was even even a Run the Rock 2020 campaign committee, which was officially registered with the Federal Election Commission, qualifying Johnson as a potential candidate in the 2020 election. Despite briefly polling higher than President Donald Trump at one point, he ultimately did not pursue the candidacy. Number 4. In 2020, the controversial rapper Kanye West set ambitious goals by declaring his candidacy for president. President Joe Biden emerged victorious in the election, and the founder of Yeezy conceded with a single word. Well, number three. In 2017, the ex NBA player declared his intention to run for sheriff in 2020. However, he later postponed his plans to 2024. This is not about politics for me. It's, it's something that I always wanted to do. Uh, it's, it's just about, about bringing people closer together. Number two. It's the end of an era in Californian politics with Arnold Schwarzenegger's role of governor terminated. In 2003, Schwarzenegger transitioned from his action star background to start his political journey by announcing his bid for governor of California, despite lacking any prior political experience. He won in the special recall election against former Governor Gray Davis and secured another outright win in 2006. Schwarzenegger concluded his second term, the maximum allowed by law, and left office in January 2011. We still miss you, Governor. Number 1. The Sex in the City star declared her bid for governor of New York on March 19, 2018. In a video introducing her campaign, she expressed, I was born here in New York City. New York is my home. I've never lived anywhere else. I was given chances I just don't see for most of New York's kids today. Our leaders are letting us down. Despite her efforts, Nixon was ultimately defeated by her opponent, Andrew Cuomo. Today, New York schools are the second most unequal in the entire country. That's all for today, folks. Stay tuned for more interesting celebrity news you may have missed.